Hey everyone, welcome back to Ebony with Genghis. If you're purchasing in the game, make sure to use Aptoid. Get all the best discounts in the game, up to 25%. There's other events where they will offer higher than 25%. Use the promo code Genghis. All the instructions of how to download Aptoid are in the description to the video. It honestly is the easiest way to download any new app to make purchasing, and it's the best discounts. On to the video. I want to talk about Blazins. I've ever, never actually done a pure Blazin video. I've seen lots out there. I've seen them from, you know, people who have thousands of Blazins, and it's unrealistic for most players to be able to do that. I've seen them explained improperly. I'm just going to show you basic goals with Blazins and how to go about it. So first thing, I'm just going to show you some of my Blazins, okay? Like... I coin a bit, not too much. I have a few red ones, some yellows, orange, you know, a mixture. But how do I go about selecting what I want? So when you have blazons, you have choices. You can go attack or defense. And in some cases, you can go against monsters when choosing them. And what I mean by this is, let, okay, uh, I think I've used all of these. So I'm going to have to open them, which is good because it will show you exactly how I do it. So my blazons are up here. I have, I, I don't open all of them at once because it's just difficult to manage. So what I do, I'll open say 10 at a time. So now I got all these 10. And the reason I only open 10 at a time is because it's gonna make it nice and simple for me to sort through which ones are garbage Garbage ones you use to upgrade good ones and which ones are worth keeping. So now let's look at my blazons. So I have all the 10 one, 10, the, sorry, the new 10, right? Oh my God, it just disappeared on me. Awful. But they're the ones that are not locked in. So I could find them if I want. So not a good one, not a good one, not a good one. Okay, but not really ideal when you're looking for a long-term one. So there's a couple other new ones that'll be here. Nothing really good, but as you can see, these ones are for monsters, and this is a monster set. So perfect for what I want to explain to you guys. This one's okay, Marching Siege and Defensive Siege HP. Ideally, you want Siege HP on both sides. So sometimes it just messes up like that. I don't, when you open them and they just go away. You, I think it might be like the connection to the game. I'm not sure exactly. So let's open 10 more. So I'll go into Blazons, and now I'll just click on these 10. So, nope. And then I'm clicking somewhere else on the screen to get off of that. Nope. Not, oh, not very good. Nope. 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 This one's okay, and it's on defending. So if you're doing defending ground, that might be one that you would lock in by pressing that lock button. For me, I'm not going to. Marching range attack, nope. Marching range attack and in rally range attack. This is not bad too, especially if it's on an offensive set. Nope, it's on a defensive set. So it's not good. So now let's go into my blazons. I've opened up enough and mounted. So if I go here, this is an honor set and it's all attacking buffs. Me, I go with six out of six. I don't believe in mixing and matching. Some people will let's uh look over here perfect so i have two different i have honor and souls that we can look at so honor set this is attacking soul is against monsters i don't want mounted troop against monster buffs some might want that if you do then you try and get six pieces each for each of these you would have you'd be going soul but as you can see, I have honor, and those are the ones that I've saved to, you know, evaluate. So for example, this one is, I saved this a long time ago just because it's a perfect one if I ever wanted to make a uh, monster one. But for the most part, I'm going to be throwing them away. And soul, not what I want. Honor, it's the type I want for the group buff, but it's not the correct individual blazon buffs. So everything I've opened is garbage. 
and I could use them to upgrade. So now what do I do when I want to upgrade? So this one right here, mounted troop defense, defending mounted troop defense, this is decent. It's not really perfect. So I'm, I'm just kind of waiting to upgrade it. This one, I've done this one twice and I got mounted troop HP on monsters twice. Such bad luck. Uh, so I've kind of given that a rest. And this one also not, not going very well for me. So what you want to do if you want to change it, I would go into this and I have marching mounted troop HP, reinforcing mounted troop HP, not very good. So I'm going to unlock that. I don't know why I must have accidentally locked it in the past. So I'm waiting to find ones I could upgrade. Again, here, the third blazon is mounted troop attack. So one thing that you should know if you're absolute beginner on this is you start out with two refines and when you get to level 10 like here you get a third when you get to level 15 you get a fourth and they all get stronger as well so you want to get them all to 10 um this one's an eight and it's range troop defense so this is perfect these are the best the ones that go on both sides so i'm gonna upgrade it so i just hit auto select down there and i'm gonna upgrade four and a half percent so now i want to upgrade it again to 27 I don't have enough, okay? So what I can use these, I can upgrade it, or what I wanna show you, actually, you know what? Let's upgrade this just to, for, to make it easier at the next stage of what I wanna show you. So on my blazons, the reason I open up 10 at a time, if I open up a lot, like let's say I open up, I'm gonna open 11 here, okay? And I'm going to go through these just because if I don't, it's going to be very time consuming. But then I'm going to show you what happens if you don't go through these. So I got all garbage there. Nothing I would want. So now if I go into my blazons here and we're on range, we're trying to do this one. So if I go here, let's find one that has more. So right here. So this could end up being, if I open up 200 at once, this could end up being like 30. And then I got to click and look and look and decide which ones I would want. It's just so much more time consuming than doing 10 or 20 at a time in the inventory. So that's basically how blazons work. And now this is the big one, number 10. Am I going to get a good one or not? If I get a good one, I get to keep this and it's awesome. And if I get a bad one, uh, then I got a decision to make. What do we get? In rally, range troop defense. That is pretty good. It's not perfect, but range troops, they, they are used a lot in rallies. And if you're setting a rally against a monster, this works as well. So it's okay. There could have been worse. I could have got reinforcing range troop. I could have got range troop load. I could have got range troop training capacity, range troop against monsters. So this is okay. This is like kind of the number four or three option. I'm pretty happy with that. Now the key is going to be what's the fourth. Um, that's basically how you should do your blazons. Now let's talk about what you should actually select. So for me, I'm, you know, uh, no, you know, humbly, no bragging. This is a big account. It's an all-star finalist account. Sometimes, sometimes I don't make it. But anyways, it's a big account, the top account on server. I'm gonna, I have very good defense, very good attacking. But to me, you know, no one's really attacking me to give me points in regular Battlefield or SVS. So I have to attack. So I need attack buffs. I get attacked, you know, if we're overmatched in Battlefield or in All-Stars. That's it. So if I go all defensive refines, it's like, ooh, look at my report. Look at my buffs. But it's really not helping me much. So realistically, I have attack on everything. And this one worked out very good. Pretty happy with that. And then this one's on its way to being good. Going to level that one up soon. But for me, I go with attacking ground. If you're... You know, if you're a low coiner and you're in an alliance that rallies a lot, like I'm going to use an example. So let's say you're in an, like 
a, you know, a top five Shalons alliance, but you're not the best player. You sit there and fill rallies. You might be best with defensive refines, defense on your blazons. Protect you when you're, in, when you're joining the rallies and all your troops go into the rallies. It's important to help fill the rally, but you're not the rally setter. You don't have the buffs setting the rally, that sort of stuff. And then, you know, when you level up, you'll get a couple in rally stuff. That's okay. But you're not the main lead. You're not doing the ground solos. So you might want to have defensive ground. For range, the only option is range against monsters or range attack. I, I, range is, uh, I, for all your range refines, you pretty much really want to go with offensive range refines. Archers attack. They're not very good on defense. I think this is an easy choice. I think basically everyone in the game should be going with archer attack. I can't think of a scenario where anyone would go defense. Mounted. This is one where uh, it could go either way. Some people really want those defensive mounted buffs. They want the mounted HP, the mounted defense. But horses are so good both ways. So this is kind of a balanced one and it's going to be by choice. Some people don't keep horses, right? So there's a lot of keeps out there that they have a low amount of horse. They sit in with their alliance. They join rallies. They ghost their horse. So you can have offensive horse buffs. Don't go with the horse HP stuff, though, against monsters. I wouldn't go with that. So if you look at my horse stuff the reason they're yellow and not red even though horse is super important i've just had terrible luck with the blazing refines look at this i got training capacity on this one monsters i showed you this double monster already monster i've had such bad luck i just kind of gave up on them siege siege is the one you could go either way can't fault you but basically i would say for most people defense is going to be the way to go for siege uh only your real big players who have, you know, 18, 1900, 2000 plus siege attack refines should be going offensive on this. I think, you know, because really if you're going to go with, you know, if you're a, a mid coiner, a low coiner and your siege attack is 1500, 1600, that may be better than most people who play, but it's not better than the people who play SVS and you're going to try and get hits on. So you're rarely going to find a matchup where your siege will come in favorable for you against your opponent. So you'd be better off having defensive siege refines. That's my opinion. So I've got pretty lucky on my siege stuff. So we'll take a look at them. So really, really happy with how they've turned out, except this one. I have to change this one. Uh, this one's not bad too, reinforcing siege HP, because with siege, you do reinforce a lot. So I'm really happy with how these ones are going. Uh, it's probably maybe my best set I've had. So anyways, that is how I uh, value Blazons. That's how I do it. And I do it slowly. I don't do it all the time. Uh, as you can see, I have them in the inventory. I just open them up 10 or 20 at a time. I go through them. I make a little, you know, a note with a key, the gold key. I save the ones that are possible to use in the future. Because like I showed you, you're going to get bad refines and then you need a backup one, right? So then you got to unlock that. I'll show you here exactly what I'm talking about. So horse, I've had really bad luck, right? So what you're going to have to do is you're going to have to unlock that. Then you're going to have to put a different one on. And then you're going to have to go to upgrade with that one. And that's the only way to do it. And then you're going to have to feed that, uh, this honor, honor wind blazing. But here, I'm going to show you a little tip. So um, I can't upgrade this right now, right? It's not here. The red one's not available. Why isn't it there? Because I haven't saved yet. So I have to save. And now I, the game protects you. One of the few times Evany protects you from making a mistake. So now this honor wind has no lock and it's not saved in a preset. Now I can use it to upgrade, but I'm not gonna do that because even though it rolled poorly, it is still my top blazon just because of the, uh, 
the high percentages from being a level 15. But that is, you know, I don't know. I'm going to have to try it again. But horse has been bad. It's been really hard for me to find too good HP as the initial uh, refine also. So not doing well on those. I don't know if anyone else has had those problems. Let me know in the comments your thoughts on Blazin. Anyways, like, subscribe, leave a comment.